okay so in previous video we have seen that how to print hello world in our asp.net now we will see the coding of master page and we will edit the master page and make it a little bit attractive okay so we will click here on the a flaky tech master mm -hmm. I don't know why it's looking like this. Should we look like this? One minute. We we'll just close this down and we'll again open this page. Okay, so here we go. So as we can design view, we can see the design of the master page or of our website. Mm, next some videos I will show you what is the main use of master page, why we use this master page for coding and not for a simple web form. I will teach you in next web um, next tutorials because you will not get properly in this tutorial okay so here we'll start that is taking so much time I don't know why let's close down it again and let's start now okay so we'll do the coding here we'll see you may see the contest placeholder will be definitely here and here then here the division starts so we will start our work from here near div will give the style which is equal to style equal to will give the height this is like thousand px even given person is also but i prefer to given thousand px make sure you write here colon not equal to and then after and make sure you have this semicolon otherwise it will generate error you will see like this it is like hundred sorry hundred percent so see here it is showing an arrow we'll fix it so here we go and then this is not a border Give the background color. Background color should be black. Black is cool, but no. Don't give it in double quotes. Okay. So what is the division to do? I have given. I just control S, and then click on home page and press control F. No need to start the. Uh, activity because it will take time and it, then afterwards you will forget if you forget to debug it will generate some error see now you have seen here the whole page is displaying a black color so the master is a success will be done as well now in the division it is just for an example we have to this in the division we will take another division the name here this is the style. This is equal to that's how it will be for let's take an 80px. We will take for header and width will be generally sorry, width will generally be uh, 100 percent. Okay, let us take a background color. Remove your black, I will give it F1. This is able to use my favorite line. And then Ctrl S, and then afterwards, same home page. So you can see now, it has the whole as blue and upper as black, so header is black in color, and the rest of our page is blue in color. Now let us go ahead and make the side. We have made the header. I will make the photo. Make sure you press this content inside, more inside, so you better know what you wrote in which line. So the error will be grace as fast as possible. I prefer to do this. It will take a little bit of time, but an error it will the error will be solved very fast. And this is computed. This is our middle path, and then after 
the last you will press footer take here make sure you will go style the height let us see the height as it is Value semicolon, then after semicolon, then the width will be the fix 300%. Then after, just give a background color. Let's see it in white. This is just an example. We'll take a proper color and proper CSS to do to look at our website very pretty and very more attractive and powerful so oops for it okay so we have not assigned here the float value so it is assigned here first we make a partition of this between we have set here the footer we need here and the header is here so in between part we have to adjust the uh, height of the <clears throat> of our website so I, I will make a, another div here in between and set the height of that so in between this div and this div make a partition with another div div sorry div then I have a press type equal to oh sorry style equal to height is let us say what is the remaining value it's 116 and 840 if I am not wrong yes I am right <laughs> so then width will be then so it will be 100% again yeah now let it do it now then I have background color let us take background color Okay. So are you gonna directly control F5 here and refresh your page? Well, so you can see. So your website is looking good right now from the phone. So okay. So it is now looking very good. Now what is the theme with that this okay the next video just mention the next video we'll watch some more CSS in our website. So keep watching my video and please subscribe and like if you like this video. Thank you.